I guess I just wanted to know, like, you know, like, I don't know, the disconnect and mm. what was going through your mind. Because I know there's a lot that didn't happen or didn't show. Yeah. So, if, yeah. This whole process and coming into it, I knew that I was able to give it everything, but I didn't truly believe that I would be one of those people who would be able to fall in love with two people. Yeah. That's just not something that I ever thought was possible. And as this whole story unfolds, you see that when you are giving 100%, like I said I was going to from the very beginning, it's very possible and it's hard because of that. And as these days were winding down and as I shared my thoughts and feelings with you, those were my true, honest thoughts and feelings. Um, I cared and I do care about your feelings. I care about you as a person. And my decision to share that I was in love with you, um, I wasn't sharing that because I already had made a decision. I was sharing that because it was something that I had been holding back. And because I didn't think I was capable of falling in love with two people, it was really hard for me to honestly come out and talk about that because it's scary and you're dating in the public eye and there's all these different things and, you know, you do. You see people get ridic ridiculed for falling in love with two people. Yeah. And... Which is very I, possible, falling in love with two people. Which it is, and saw. it's not an easy thing um, to be in this position, but I had asked you guys to be completely honest and vulnerable with me the entire time, and that is something that you gave to me from the very start, and that's why my feelings could get to that point. And as I'm feeling those feelings, I felt like it would also do the relationship as, to a disservice to not share them. And now if I would have known my decision in that moment and still had strong feelings, like I'm, I'm always a person to think about somebody else. But in this unique position, I wanted to be completely honest with where I was at, and that was that I was in love with you. And saying that, it was hard at that time, because it's scary. Yeah. Um, and it's scary with also knowing that you might have to break somebody's heart with who you said you love you. T I love you too, and that's not easy either. Yeah. And yeah, because you know, I mean, I had a going home, I wasn't okay, you know? Like, thank God for, you know, everyone, but um, I just, you know, prepared myself watching it because I knew, like, I was gonna have to watch it, I was gonna have to face you at some point, and, um, I mean, honestly, I thank you, just because I've never been that vulnerable in a relationship in my entire life. Usually I am reserved. Usually I don't show emotions because I don't know where it's gonna go yet or where it's gonna lead to. Um, I think, you know, just to me, it was hard watching because I was so truly in love with you. I was beyond in love with you and, you know, I was in love with your family and everything that came with that and, I don't know, it's, I, in a way, like, on the other side, like, I felt like a little bit my love was overlooked. Um, but also, I didn't know the full story. You know, I only knew my portion, I only knew my part, and yeah, I mean, that last day was tough, and I mean, I knew you were gonna break my heart, because unfortunately with you, I knew that you show your emotions through your eyes. Everything you do, you show it through your eyes. And when I walked up, I saw that, of course, your heart was pointing in a different direction, and with the B and everything, that didn't make it <laughs> any easier. Um, but yeah, I just, you know, at the end of the day, I do wish you the best. And I wish you guys a happy, happy life together. And yeah, you know, just a little confused. Just a little confused. Um, I saw, you know, that you did want it to be Nate. And, you know, just this is everything before you, and like you tell me everything. And yeah, you can fall in love with two people. And I really appreciate you sharing that with me because that's not easy. And like breaking someone's heart isn't easy. But I just felt like, you know, you really had to push Nate to that point. And it was just kind of confusing when you never had to question me, but you had to keep questioning him. 
But again, like, sometimes we don't understand what our heart is telling us. And then sometimes, you know, you know what you want. So I just, at the end of the day, just thank you because you gave me strength, you know, and your family did. And your family gave me a lot of good pointers, like going into marriage and how to have success, a very successful marriage. And yeah. Um, That's sweet. Yeah, so. I think that's really nice, and I really appreciate you both being here, and I hope you got answers and closure. I know it wasn't easy for either one of you.